Hey everybody, it's Channel Vince here. Welcome to my channel. And today I'm just going to take you around downtown Montreal. I'm going to show you my favorite spots, where to, the places you can't miss. Alright, let's get to it. Okay, so here I'm on Crescent Street. And to me, this is one of the most charming boulevards in all of Montreal. It's fun just to take a stroll down these streets and take a look around, especially on a bright and sunny day like today. Such a sucker tourist today. I got my Canada hat on. I'm out here with my phone filming. It's a, it's a whole shtick. And here I'm on St. Catherine Street, which is ideal for perusing up and down retail shops, left and right for all tastes. It's inevitable that when you're in Montreal, you're gonna encounter a lot of construction, a lot of renovation. That's just the nature of any developed city, but particularly here. And check this out. I came across a Ben and Jerry shop. I haven't even come across one of these back home. Here in Montreal, you're bound to run into one of these pristine churches from centuries ago, just in the middle of bustling downtown. It's a funny ju juxtaposition, and it always uh, catches me by surprise. They're a beauty to admire. And here's just a little helpful advice if uh, you plan on traveling to Canada. If back home you have TD branches, you should definitely consider opening an account because it really facilitates the transfer of funds and the use of credit cards. So here on Sherbrooke and Crescent is where you'll find um, all the museums, galleries, all those kinds of uh, the exhibits. And this is one of the many beautiful touristy plazas you can find around. They got little kiosks with all little knickknacks, souvenirs. They got a monument behind us. It's just a nice, nice place to stroll around and sightsee a bit. And, and here we have A and W, hands down the best burger joint around. And the best part, they're open 24 hours, so you can get that craving satisfied at any hour. And for those interested, Guns Famous serves the best pastrami around. <clears throat> Despite all the other savory options, I'm going with a nostalgic taste from back home. And here we have a Canadian institution behind me. This is Tim Hortons. No trip to Canada is complete without a visit here. You can get your, your morning brew, you can get a little pastry with it. In the city, you'll find these entrances that lead to the metro and the underground city which I made a video about previously. I'll leave a link below in the description box. And uh, yeah, it's really accessible all throughout and it helps you get up and down if you get a little tired of walking or it gets too cold, depending on the time of year. All right, everybody, that's it for this time. That's just a little glimpse of what downtown Montreal has to offer. Let me know your thoughts down below. All right, I'll see you next time.